Hello ladies and gentlemen, Georgia64 here, aka the Hypocritical Gamer, bringing you the next episode of Nino Kuni. And here we are in this beautiful world. We're off to the- oh no, I don't want to fight right now, no! <sighs> so we are heading north. No, that's not north, that... This way is north. Yep, I am not running. Okay, there we go. Anyway, yeah. We are heading north to the Deep Dark Forest. No, fine. Deep Dark Forest. So I think I remember seeing where to get... Uh, where, where the entrance to the Deep Dark Forest is. Yep. So I, I read a little bit of the, uh, you know, a little uh, wizard's journal or whatever it was called. And I found out uh, quite a few certain things, you know, about... Uh, I'm having difficulty remembering the terms used, but like, like changing emotions and whatnot. Like, you, if people have too much, you take it and you give it to people who don't have enough. Whoa! Careful. Oh no! This is a dead end. Well, I could have seen that if I was looking at the map. Stupid. These guys are. These guys are also kind of stupid. They are just like. They. These guys run right past me. They are not as, you know, into this, into chasing me as birds are. Yep, I'll be looking forward to, uh, I think it's, uh, getting, I get some sort of pendant or watch. I'm gonna find him. Alright, man, those birds are, they'll follow you to the ends of the earth, and they're fast, the bastards. So, in case, oh, they're following, oh, man. What is he doing? Oh, ouch! Oh, yikes. Okay, I need to heal myself. Indeed. Yep. Awesome. Okay. Now let's get him. I don't know what he was doing, but that was crazy. All right. No, no. There we go. Come on. Come on. Stop that. There we go. Oh, that was health right there. Or anyway, in case you guys didn't notice, my, uh, they're speaking English again. And the reason for that is, is that it is a lot easier for me to commentate on things when they're actually speaking my language. It's harder when it's Japanese. So, let's go to the forest. Plus, the majority of people requested English. The Deep Dark Wood, Forest of Fairy Tales. Hmm. Is this where the Lord High Lord of the Fairies uh, has his domain, maybe? Look at that! It's a waystone! That, that is useful. A waystone? Yeah, man. There are these ancient stones, see. You can use them to store a record of your adventures so far. In wild places like forests and so on, you can't just plonk yourself on the nearest rock and write your old story down. But why not? Why not, he says. Give me strength, man. Because they're crawling with horrible beasties, ain't it? They are? That sounds kinda scary. You'll get used to it, mon. Just remember you can't go recording your progress any, w any old way. So allow me to explain a little more. Touch your waystone and your health and magic power will be fully restored. Not bad, eh? Ah, I'm very happy about that. And that's not all, man. These little beauties will also let you save your progress. A traveler's best friend they are. Which is why you should stop at every waystone you see and make good use of it. Better safe than sorry, innit? Sure, Mr. Drippy. Tidy, that's what I like to hear. Let's hope you're as good as your word. Right on, next stop, the old man of the woods. Yep, I need to get that pendant or whatever. Alright, let's... Hooray! Yes! Alright, let's go check things out. There any sparklies to examine? There has to be something in here. All of this forest and nothing? I don't believe it. First of all, here's no- Oh, what are you doing, man? The old man of the woods is right nearby. The bastard, I want to explore. I thought this was an RPG. Ooh, I'm in the water. Can't really do much, but it's still cool. 
All right. I'm coming, Drippy. I'm coming. Mr. Drippy! Wait for me! You dropped the wand and the book. Who goes there? God, is it the great owl? Jeepers. Oh, damn it! Jeez! <laughs> I didn't uh, actually expect that. Oh, Drippy, it's you. And to what do I owe the pleasure? Well, I got a visitor by her from another world, see? And what it is is, I was wondering if you might lend us a bit of a hand, like. Oh, I should have known. You only ever come to see me when you are in need. Sorry, you tall ship. You know I'm always very grateful. Hmm. This boy. Ah, spotted it, did you, you bark ship? Well, well. Your bark ship? The pure hearted one. He who will drive out the darkness. So where is his, uh, Nino Kuni counterpart? To... That's right, your ancient ship. We're off to give Shadar a right royal hiding. You? Why? <laughs> as reckless as ever, I see. Very well. You shall have my aid. But first, we had better give the boy a familiar, had we not? Ooh, a familiar. Oh, ho, 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 yeah. Clean forgot I did. He's right, Dolly Boy. It might be a bit early, but I suppose we better teach you how to conjure up familiars, innit? Familiars? Yeah, familiars. You're in our world. You can magic up little fighting creatures from your heart. See? They're called familiars. Where we're going, the beasties are only going to get bigger and meaner. So you're going to need a helping hand. That's or right. Claw, or beak. Or tentacle. Can I really do it? Well, there's only one way to find out. You want to help your mom, don't you? Uh, sure I do. Well then, grab your wizard's companion and turn to the page marked Form Familiar. All right, I know exactly where that is. But Mr. Drippy, there's no spell named Form Familiar here. Uh-huh. That was weird. You what? The boy is correct. Look at his wizard's companion. It would seem that it is missing more than a few of its pages. Oh yeah, I noticed that. Really, knickers? Ah, uh, knickers! Alright. So does that mean I can't cast a spell? Ho ho ho. I am not as alp as powerless as all that young man. Oliver, was it? Let me see now. Form familiar. Ah, oh, yes. A gift from me to you, young Oliver. Yay! He just made that from his own tree stuff. So we're gonna have to collect the missing pages, huh? Right. You received a page describing the form familiar spell. Thank you very much, old Father Oak. But simply possessing the page for a particular spell is no guarantee that you will be able to make use of it. Some spells are simply not meant for certain wizards. Such is life. Don't worry about that now, man. Just give a form familiar a go, will you? Sure thing, Mr. Drippy. Alright. Form familiar. It doesn't cost any MP. How nice. Oh, this is weird. That's tidy work, Ollie boy. Look at that. A warrior from your very own heart. A familiar. This is a familiar? That's right. The fighting spirit inside you made flesh. A soldier. I was, I was really soul. expecting it to be um, an animal. Really like an actual animal. Ooh. Ooh. <sighs> huh? Ouch! Saw that coming. That was a mean trick. And the stronger you get, the harder he's gonna hit as well! <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Alright, so this is a familiar, huh? And he'll be coming with us? Indeed he will, Ollie boy. The more the merrier, innit? Here you'd better give the fit little fellow a name, eh? Oh, Mighty, huh? Uh, yeah, I'll just go with default name, it's okay. 
mighty it is. Yes. Oliver, we cannot let you set off into the wild with only that withered wand in your hand. Let me give you some spells to aid you in battle. The first is the restorative incantation known as Healing Touch. Oh, yay! I got it! And what's another one? Tidy, that's the most useful spell there is for a wandering adventurer. Cuts, bruises, sprains, gashes, all gone in a jiffy with healing touch. Gee, you make it sound like I'm going to get hurt an awful lot, Mr. Drippy. Next, I give you the gift of the Blazing Inferno. Fireball! I love fire magic. Shoots a little ball of fire, that one does. Plant-based beasties flipping hate fire, man. Even old Dreeface here is scared of Fireball. Drippy, how dare you? You would never aim such a spell at me, would you, boy? Golly, of course not, old Father Oak. Awesome! So, now, boy, you can press square at any time to open your spells menu. While a spell like Healing Touch can be used at any time, Fireball is meant primarily for use in battle. That said, the most unexpected of spells can prove incomparably useful, given the right set of circumstances. Novel problems call for novel solutions, after all. If you find yourself at something of a loss, I recommend that you go through your magical repertoire. You never know which spell might save the day. Awesome! Who is that? Uh-oh. Huh? Spoiling for a fight, is it? Better give him what he wants, Ollie boy. Huh? But what do I do? Just think what you want him to do and he'll do it. It's as easy as falling off a log, man. Okay. Just think what I want him to do. Here goes. <laughs> Uh-oh. Man, these things don't Let's even look do dangerous. I could just kick them. And it's like, alright. Right to Wooly Boy, it's time to learn about fighting with familiars. First off, you've got to pick who's going to fight out out of you and your little friend. We've gone to the trouble of making him, so we'd best give him a go, eh? Select him, will you? Yep, sure thing. Here goes. Right, tidy now, let's send him into the fray, shall we? Oh yeah, see that circle in the top left there? I sure do. That's your familiar stamina gauge. What that does is, is it shows you how much longer he can fight for, see? The longer you keep him on the go, the shorter his stamina gauge will get. When, it, when it's empty, that means the poor lad's so tired he can't fight anymore. Tragic, eh? So before that happens, you have to call him back to you for a bit of rest, like. Oh, and there's something else about familiars you should know. See this little mark right here? That's his sign. Oh, yeah? Is it like, what, fire style or something? It's sort of like a star sign, except there's only four of them. Sun, moon, star, and planet. Okay, so what is this one? Sun, then? And like star signs, different ones get on... Different ones get on better. You can use that to help you in battle. Next, let's talk about tricks. They're proper uh, powerful spells, a bit like your spells. And just like spells, they cost MP to use. You can see the cost written next to them. Alright. Cut loose, defend. But what you've got to remember is that you and your familiars share MP and HP. So if a familiar uses a trick or takes a big hit, it's your MP and HP that'll suffer. Uh-oh. Crikey, this is a long old lesson, eh? Yeah, ca yeah, kind of. Right, let's finish with a top tip, shall we? Your familiar stamina is always going down, so you'll need to swap with him regularly. Regularly, yeah. You can do that anytime you like by pressing L1, innit? Now, I'm going to stop talking before I put us both to sleep. It's your turn to sing for your supper. Go on, boy, back. Okay, cut loose! Come on, go get him! Oh, look at me go! Woohoo! Alright. Come on, let's attack again. Oh, I missed! Okay, there we go. Attack! Okay, no, no, no. Don't you dare. There we go! I got him! You can't dodge me! Alright, come on. Let's kill him before I have to... Oh, I'm running out of time. There we go. Okay. The gauge was running out. I was like, I want to, uh... 
fix the I'm gonna finish this up before the gauge runs out. Yay, I can level him up! Got eight gold. My T has reached level two. So now you know how to fight with a familiar, ain't it, Ollie boy? To be a true contender, you'll have to you'll need to learn when to let your familiars loose and when to take control yourself. I'll do oh I'll do my best, Mr. Drippy. Hooray, mighty! Oh, and when he's not fighting, the little fellow can be found taking it easy in the creature cage. Alright, you can shower your faithful familiars with a delicious treat. Oh, okay, cool. Well, there's all kinds of treats to choose from. Some will improve their abilities, and there's other other ones that can even teach them new tricks. Tidy! Feed the little blighters enough of what they fancy, and the bonds of familiarity between you will grow. Meaning you can boost their abilities even more. Careful not to stop them with too full of sweeties, though. They'll only end up getting full up. Adoration and moderation, that's the key. It's probably a lot to get your head around, but just remember that the creature cage is where you look after your familiars. And take it from there, ain't it? The creature cage? Got it. I promise to look after him real well, Mr. Drippy. Hooray! It's accessible. Oh, I almost forgot. Of course you did. We had something we wanted to ask you, your trunkiness. There's a guard down in Ding Dong Dell, and he's broken hearted, see? Mm, broken hearted, you say? Shadar's evil spread still further, so you will be needing. That we will, your Okitude. <laughs> These are terrible names. There's. There's quick you are. You have still got it, ain't, ain't it? <laughs> Patience, young Drippy. Of course I have. Let me see now. Hmm, I know it's here somewhere. Crikey, you've not gone and lost it, have you? I have to find it. There we go. Lost it? The insolence. I put it away safely among my upper branches. It's just a little tangled up there, that's all. Ah, while I seek it out, I have a favour to ask of you. Well, I did mention we're in a flippin' hurry, didn't I? We haven't got time to go. Mr. Drippy, we should help old Father Oak. He gave us this, those spells, didn't he? Oh, how very refreshing to meet such a responsible and honest young man. Yeah, Drippy, what the hell's wrong with you? All right, all right, I'll get the flippin' message. Go on. What is it you need us for? Well, it's the guardian of these woods, you see. The guardian, eh? What's up with the old fellow? I'm afraid he has become rather unruly of late, and he is neglecting his duties. Well, 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 that's no good, isn't it? We'd better help you sort him out then, eh? The Guardian, he sounds kinda tough. Too right he is. He is way stronger than your average beastie. But you've got a familiar on your side now, man. You'll be fine. And besides, if you're going to take down Shadar, you can't back out of a bit of light Guardian bashing now, can you? Okay, I'll do it. How very kind of you. The Guardian can be found in the deepest part of the wood, beyond the whispering waterfalls. I wish you luck. Of course it's in the deepest part. If you're a Guardian, shouldn't you kind of probably be near close to the outskirts to just keep people from destroying it and coming in and stuff? I don't know. Right, first spells, now familiars. You're turning into a proper wizard, ain't it, Ollie boy? I guess I am, huh? Now then, why don't you take a closer look at your new mate, eh? Uh, how do I do that, Mr. Drippy? It's a piece of cake, Mom. Now listen up. All right, main menu, friends and familiars. That's where you'll find all sorts of details about you and your familiar abilities. It looks a bit complicated, and there are a fair few options kicking about in there. To be fair, but you'll soon get the hang of it, man. All right, now you're still new to this wizarding luck, so there's a limit to what you can do, ain't it? But keep fighting monsters, and eventually you'll get stronger. We can we call that leveling up, see? Of course you do. You'll probably make some new mates before long, and also be sure to take a closer look at them, like I showed you. You got it, Mr. Drippy. Alright, it's now accessible. Hooray! So we've got some looking around to do. What is over this way? Over here, here's all of this. Fireball, and here's all of them. Okay, cool. Okay. 
Man, this music is like real crazy right now. Oh, now I can go this way. Cool. <gasps> A treasure chest. Come on, what do we got? Ooh, white bread. Nice. Great, we've got to find more places. Uh-oh, it's a cave. All right, when am I going to start finding people to fight? It has to be here somewhere. Uh-oh. Ooh, wow, look at this place. Oh, he's just asking for a fight, I can tell. Uh, best warn you, oldie boy, it's absolutely crawling with monsters beyond here. Careful you don't get got before you even get to the garden, eh? I'll be fine, Mr. Drippy. I have a familiar to help me now. Yeah, and you have Fireball. That's br There's Braveyard. Don't forget, though, if the going gets tough, don't be afraid to cast Healing Touch. I sure won't. And remember what old Treeface told you? The spells menu is a mere tap of square away. You should try to familiarize... Familiarize yourself with the main menu too while you're at it. Don't worry, you're not going to break anything no matter what you press. So have a good old poke around, innit? And when you learn new skills and that, new options will come up on the main menu. So keep your eyes peeled and make the most of your new toys. Jeepers, there's so much to remember. You'll soon get used to it all, man. No worries. Now pass the whispering waterfalls and go on to the Guardian of the Woods we go. I didn't read that properly. Right, let's go help him get back to normal. Alright, here we are. Let's actually check this. Uh, friends and familiars. We've got this guy. Tricks? Cut loose? Hmm. Okay. So, level 10. No, level 5 is when I get Sandblast. Alright. So I should use this guy a lot so I can level him up. Can I level up spells as well? Or is it just familiars? Ah, here we are. Alright, let's check it out. Oh, I see you. I'm gonna get you. You're a plant thingy, right? Alright. Teeny bopper. I know, whipper snapper. Okay, yep. We'll use a familiar. And uh, we shall... Whoops. What? What just happened? Okay, let's... uh. No, 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 that's the wrong one. L1. There we go. I don't know what that was all about. Ouch. Come on. There we go. Ah, okay. Don't you dare hurt me too much. Oh, he's guarding himself. No, I don't want to lock onto you. I want to lock on. There we go. All right, come here, you. There, yes, yeah, so close. There we go. We got him. Okay. Now. Back to Ollie Boy. And spells. Fireball. You bastard. <sighs> Alright. So we both should have leveled up. Yay, level 4. Got 11 gold. Stats go up. Everything is awesome. What else do we have here? Oh, I see. Got to do some traveling. But wait, hold on. Oh, okay. I, I thought I saw something to examine. But no, that was just being able to talk to Drippy. Ooh, a treasure chest. Don't mind if I... Come on. Don't mind if I do. There we go. All right, a bar of chocolate. Oh, that's going to be amazing. Hey, you. All right. We've got more to do, more to see. Oh, we've got paths now. Now it's getting confusing. Oh, well he got me. Oh, look at this treasure chest. It's blue. It's different. All sealed. Alright, I want to try something actually. Let's go to the creature cage. Yep. Okay, I want I just want to give him a treat. See how it works. Do you like it? Yay! Attack went up. Cool. That's all I got. C 
crikey. I knew there was something I'd forgot to tell you about familiars. Huh? What's that? This is important, Ollie boy, so listen carefully, alright? I showed you how your familiars can use tricks, didn't I? Well, as little fellows get stronger, they'll start learning new ones. I already know that. Yep, 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 I know. I'll figure it out. There are a lot of tutorials. I mean, it's good to have just in case people just don't get it. Well, you know, it's okay. I'll be fine. Okay, treasure chest. I need you. Loaf of bread. Perfect. Where does this path lead? Ooh, haha! No, you don't! You're not gonna get me. Oh, oh, he was totally behind me and I didn't even know it. Watch this! Is that a spittoo? Alright, I am watching. Oh, shoot. Okay, now, ow! You bastard! Hold on, no, I'm, I'm locked onto the wrong person. I need you. There's spells and fireball. You gonna die! There we go. See? Told you. And now, we will go to... Good old Mighty here. You take him out, Mighty. I'm counting on you. Ow. Come on. There we go. Alright, get that. Yay! Alright. Onward and... Onward. I don't, I don't know what I'm saying. We've got to find where we can go. Everywhere. Ah! I didn't see you. <laughs> Alright. One more level up for Mighty and he'll be all good. He'll have a new ability. Oh. You, eh? I can easily take you out with my fireball, but I only have three MP left. Speaking of which, do I have something that actually... Okay, yeah. Iced coffee. Yep. Don't mind if I do. There we go. I can use magic again. Don't mind me. Ah! Still don't know how to open that blue treasure chest, how to break that spell or whatever. So let's just keep on going. No, 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 no! Oh. Yeah, we got a level up. Awesome job, Oliver. Alright, here we are. I have a feeling we're getting very close, especially since this music get, uh, got louder. But we'll have to go and talk to the Guardian of the Woods in the next episode because we are out of time. So until next time, this has been Georgia64, aka The Hypocritical Gamer. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.